What's up guys, Steampunk Gamer Girl here. We are back with Mass Effect and as per usual Valencard is here being a dick. Hi guys. Douche. Yeah. Oh. oh yeah, I've got something to say about this area right here. Is it great? No. I went through like a friggin' isle a friggin' planet of death. And he thinks two men are gonna stop me. Oh no, two men. Wait, is that the Krogan guy or the um Saren. Saren. Oh wow. Well. To be fair, the guess are just machines. Highly advanced machines built by the quarry. I was right here. You were right here, yeah, yeah. I was right here. Y'all fuck that shit up. Oh. I, I'm going. I'm. I'm just going. I'm so mad right now. Do the maintenance. Maintenance. <laughs> beep, 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 beep. Janitorial. Yeah, take our shit from the janitorial department. <laughs> you need to speak to the doctor. That is an elevator. So kind of. I need to come out here and go over there. Right? Yeah, there, right there, right. I can go. I know, I saw the exclamation right, mark. Right here. One day we'll get face cam and I'll have to start wearing clothes around the recording. <laughs> oh! I know it's You made that sound so gross. You j <laughs> you're in pants, you just got no top on. Yeah, I know, but nobody wants to see my man I didn't tell anyone, I swear! That was smart, Dot. Now, if Garrus comes around, you stay smart. Keep your mouth shut or we'll... Who are you? Let her go. Ah! Who's next? Pew! Shooting him in the butt. <laughs> Blasting him with your own bio tanks. There's one last guy. How, how do I own crouch? I don't know. If I can crouch button again. What's Control. That was one. I know, I blasted him with my boot takes. Quick, shoot the fire containment system. Shoot it. Now. Area secure. Uh, Area secured. He's having the time of his life right now. <laughs> Yay! Well, it's gotten out of this miserable thing called life. Crouch. X. Uh-oh. Oh. Is it X? Let's see. Is it not control? It's control. I thought I tapped control. No, you pressed one. No, I did that on purpose. Oh, then you pressed something fucking else. Possibly shift. Maybe. Aid station. In okay, case you need some aids. Why am I walking really? Because you hit control. Perfect timing, but Shepard. Gave me a clear shot at that bastard. I'll see. You took him down clean. Sometimes you get lucky. Doctor Michelle, are you hurt? No, I'm okay. Thanks <laughs> to you. Who's haunted? I just say otherwise. <laughs> Why were they threatening you? Who do they work for? They work for Feast. Beast. They wanted to shut me up, keep me from telling Garrus about the Quarian. Does this have anything to do with the investigation into Saren? I think it might. Dr. Michelle, tell us what happened. A few days ago, a Quarian came by my office. She'd been shot, but she wouldn't tell me who did it. I could tell she was scared, probably on the run. She asked me about the Shadow Broker. She wanted to trade information in exchange for a safe place to hide. Where is she now? I put her in contact with Fist. He's an agent for the Shadow Broker. Not anymore. Now he works for Saren. And the Shadow Broker isn't too happy about it. Fist betrayed the Shadow Broker? That's stupid even for him. Saren must have made him quite the offer. That Quarian must have something Saren wants. Something worth crossing the Shadow Broker to get. 
What else can you tell me about the Quarian? I'm not sure. Like I said, she wanted to trade information for a place to hide. She didn't... Wait a minute. Geth. Her information had something to do with the Geth. She must be able to link Saren to the Geth. There is no way the Council can ignore this. Time we paid Fist a visit. This is your show, Shepard. But I want to bring Saren down as much as you do. I'm coming with you. You're a Turian. Why do you want to bring him down? I couldn't find the proof I needed in my investigation, but I knew what was really going on. Saren is a traitor to the Council, and a disgrace to my people. Welcome aboard, Garrus. You know, we aren't the only ones going after Fist. The Shadow Broker hired a Krogan bounty hunter named Rex to take him out. Yeah, we saw him in the bar. A Krogan might come in handy. Last I heard, he was at the CSEC Academy. Oh, What's he doing there? Krogan. Fist accused him of making threats. We brought Rex in for a little talk. If you hurry, you can catch him at the Academy before he leaves. Move out. <laughs> now, are you gonna send one of these bitches home? You? Um. What does... I think that's costumes. Okay, so... Something. Um. You only have two with you. Okay. Yeah! I got my Garrus. Woot woot. If you feel lucky, we should visit the casino over in Flux. Ah, for Flux sake. To the Seasick Academy, again! I think it must be like C or something that we pressed. There we go, it was Z. Z? But there's an answering along. Uh, you stay there. No, <laughs> Now, there's an elevator directly to the Seasick Academy downstairs. And go via this. Go via this. Seasick, yeah? Yeah. I like, by the way, how the travel car managed to go down the maintenance tunnels. <laughs> I think I see him. Really? Oh, there it is. Witnesses saw you making threats in Fist's bar. Stay away from him. I don't take orders from you. This is your only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. I will kill him. You want me to arrest you? I want you to try. <laughs> I love him. Go on. Get out of here. Do I know you, human? My name's Shepard. I'm going after Fist. Thought you might want to come along. <sighs> Shepard. Commander Shepard. I've heard a lot about you. We're both warriors, Shepard. Out of respect, I'll give you a fair warning. I'm going to kill Fist. Fist knows you're coming. We'll have a better chance if we all work together. My people have a saying. Seek the enemy of your enemy, and you will find a friend. I think we're gonna get along just fine, Rex. Let's go. I hate to keep Fist waiting. Oh. Who are you gonna sack? I like you, Ashley. I get the feeling that But I think this mission calls for... Calls for aliens. Because I'm kind of problem with humans, I. Is that it? No, no, no. You need to go back to Char's den. Yeah, come on. The terminal thing's over there. I can get that by the elevator. You can't, you could go via the freaking sea set. The um thing, so you don't have to go through one load. Oh, Char's den. Okay. A gentleman's club in the walks. It's a fucking strip club where everybody's wearing skin tight latex, so it's not quite stripping, but it's close enough. Looks like it's shut down. Fist knows we're. Oh. Some 
biotic attack. Enemy is everywhere! Hold the line! Look at me handles the whole time because I didn't see him. All targets down. I hope you're not fist. Stop right there. Don't come any closer. Warehouse workers. All the real guards must be dead. Stay back or we'll shoot. Making a mistake. I just killed 50 bodyguards to get in here. What do you think I'll do to you? Uh, well, uh, uh screw fist. He doesn't pay us enough for this. Yay! It would have been quicker to just kill them. Shooting people isn't always the answer. I don't think these two can get along. That's half the fun, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Yes, please! Don't fuck it up. I'm gonna use that time. Oh, you got a new pistol. I kinda wanna switch now. I don't know if it's better though. Oh, this is the one way to find out. Ooh. Edge 2. It is not better than your stinger 2. No, it is not. What about. This is better than his. Yeah, but well you might want to check what he's specced into. Um, How would you do that? You go to the U screen. You exit out of there and then you grab that. Right, that's uh. Okay. So, Rex is. Oh, they're both assault rifles. <coughs> oh. There's lots of firepower there. That's awesome. Maybe I picked the right one for It's coming with me. Right then. I will check. I will sort out what um, weapons to give them after this because I've got some decent assault rifles, haven't I? I feel you're about to fight again. Time to die, little soldiers. Oh, what's he got? He has a lancet as well, so if I give Where is that one and give Rex the Banshee one. Oh, it's pretty much the same as the one he's got anyway, isn't it? You run once, so click it. It's like mm. one, more, one less shot. There you go! Damage. Me, I surrender. Tell me where the Quarian is, and I won't have to shoot you in the kneecaps. She's not, the kneecaps. She's not here. I don't know where she is. That's the truth. He's no use to you now. Let me kill him. Wait, wait. I don't know where the Quarian is, but I know where you can find her. Then tell me. The Quarian isn't here. Said she'd only deal with the Shadow Broker himself. Face to face? Impossible. Even I was hired through an agent. Nobody meets the Shadow Broker, ever. Even I don't know his true identity. But she didn't know that. I told her I'd set a meeting up. But when she shows up, it'll be Saren's men waiting for her. Tell me where that meeting is before I blow your lying head off. Here on the wards, the back alley by the markets. She's supposed to meet them right now. You can make it if you hurry. What are you doing? The Shadow Broker paid me to kill him. I don't leave jobs half done. A lot of people died because of him. He had it coming. Now let's move. We have to save that Quarian. Sweet. You have 
less than four minutes to get to the quarry. Oh. Where is she? You hear that red tunnel? Yeah. That's where you need to be. Okay. Seriously? Shouting that. Hold the line. Okay. Area secured. Awesome. Or maybe um Shepard's got a really manly voice. <laughs> Wouldn't panic. Enemies everywhere. <sighs> Just like men get really squeaky and high pitched when they're scared. So yeah. Maybe. Did you bring it? Where's the shadow broker? Where's Fist? They'll be here. Where's the evidence? No way. The deal's off. Shoot him! That's hilarious. Looks so silly with that jagger. Just set me up. I knew I couldn't trust him. Were you hurt in the fight? I know how to look after myself. Not that I don't appreciate the help. Who are you? My name's Shepard. I'm looking and for yes, evidence to yes. prove Saren's a traitor. Then I have a chance to repay you for saving my life. But not here. We need to go somewhere safe. We could take her to the human embassy. It's really loud music. Your ambassador would want to see this anyway. You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards, an all-out assault on Korra's den. Do you know how many? Who's this? A quarian? What are you up to, Shepard? This quarian can help us bring down Saren. I would have told you that if you hadn't jumped down my throat. I apologize, Commander. This whole thing with Saren has me a bit on edge. Maybe we should just start at the beginning, Miss... My name is Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. We don't see many Quarians here. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage. My rite of passage into adulthood. Tell us what you found. During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile, the Geth have never ventured beyond the Veil. I was curious. I tracked a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I disabled it and removed its memory core. I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense mechanism. How did you manage to preserve the memory core? My people created the Geth. If you're quick, Careful and lucky, small caches of data can sometimes be saved. Most of the core was wiped clean, but I salvaged something from its audio banks. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. He said Eden Prime brought him one step closer to finding the conduit. Any idea what that means? The conduit must have something to do with the beacon. Maybe it's some kind of Prothean technology. Like a weapon. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. I don't recognize that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. Are they some kind of new alien species? According to the Memory Core, the Reapers were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished. At least, that's what the Geth believe. 
Sounds a little far-fetched. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, the pinnacle of non-organic life. And they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The Council is just going to love this. This is a lot to handle. They might just ignore everything we tell them. No matter what they think about the rest of this, those audiophiles prove Saren's a traitor! The Captain's right. We need to present this to the Council right away. What about her, the Quarian? My name is Tali. You saw me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Let me come with you. I'll take all the help I can get. <laughs> Thanks. You won't regret this. I have all my favorite Anderson people Anderson and I will go ahead to get things ready with the Council. Take a few minutes to collect yourself, then meet us in the tower. You're only missing the one. Can you eventually get three? You no. need her, technically. You only get two. It's a strike team, not fucking them salt balls. So much empty space. A thousand of my people could live here and hardly even see each other. Well, thank you all for watching, guys. We've got a lot done in this episode. If you've liked it, please remember to leave a like, comment, or subscribe. And we will see you in the next episode. Bye, guys! Oh, well, folks. <laughs>